Alright, welcome back everyone. Uh, last time, we... What did we do? We found a giant cauldron that turned into a smaller one. Ooh, and uh, before stream, I did... Uh, decided I'm gonna switch back to... Switch back to the sword for a bit. I just saw a clip. Like one of the little... Uh, TikTok clips I made. And it just looked cool. You know, I, I, I'm, I'm not one for a lot of melee combat in this game, but it it does feel kind of cool. I like swords a lot more. Anyways, enough about the sword. Uh, I also figured out, like, how to, how to do the runes. I, I never realized that it says, I don't know if you can see there, at the bottom, uh, I think it's like the middle mouse button. You click it, and uh, you can change your runes. So, so I applied some runes, so. Yeah. Alright. Figure out where we're headed now. Pretty sure it's over here. Need to find a present. We'll just need to go to the guy's house first. And then we'll give him a present. I think the present is the cauldron that we found before. Yeah, I hope everyone is having a great day today. I had a pretty good day. I slept in and got all the all the homework I needed to get done today done. Hey, messed with heck yeah! Thank you for coming out. How are you? Welcome in. I don't know how much you've been watching, but uh, I am in. Some kind of like altered reality or like some special zone uh, within like Norse mythology. I think it's Jotunheim. It's like the home of the frost giants. Um, and everything likes to disappear here, so it's very <laughs> interesting trying to find things like. Okay. Like, this guy's house is probably going to be invisible, and then we have to reveal it somehow. Thurimer's house once stood here. I am Before riding a freaking... It. I think it's a reindeer. It's, 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 it's wonderful, isn't it? Isn't it just adorable? It's a cutie. Hold on. Okay, so we just go straight. Is it on top of whatever this is? Oh god. Oh god. What is attacking me? Don't hurt my reindeer! No! Flee! Flee! Evasive maneuvers! Fuck! F fuck! <laughs> <laughs> no! Oh my god. I've never ragdolled- Oh yeah, they're fucking shapeshifters, bastards! These <gasps> motherfuckers... They can, uh... Yeah, they can shapeshift. Well, my bow is not doing much to them. Come here. What the fuck are you, by the way? Whoa. It's like a snow tiger thing. Looks pretty cool. It's so fucking fast, Jesus. Just, just, yes, yes. <laughs> the terrain. Come sit back oh, what? I thought, thought that they were dead. I'm out. <laughs> There we go. We got him. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a reindeer. And I think this house... Is it this? Could it be this? I find it an accident. Must be blocked from the other side. Of course, it's always blocked from the other side. Very classic. Right. So it's pointing to the... Is it underground? Is it in the water? This dude living in the freaking water? Are you evil? Or is it this guy? Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> Sorry about you. Oh, and he just like slipped into the water. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I'm pretty dialed in, uh, 
In most games, I'd say I got some pretty good aim. Definitely this game, I got it locked in pretty well. Mm. Oh, there's a key. How do we get there without dying is the question. Okay. Cold enough to freeze the breath in your body. How's, how's your day been today? Loki often tells the tale of how Thrymia stole Did you do anything Thor's fun? Hair. It seems his account of Thor's rage was no exaggeration. What the fuck? Are these guys like... They're like frozen? Like they got froze falling or something. It's really odd. What if there's like a frost dragon or something? I haven't encountered any dragons yet. There very well could be, though. Although, I'm not sure I've ever heard of one in, a, in Norse mythology. Ah. Well, for sure I could climb up that. What about over here? No? Nope. Alright. Gotta be some way to get over there. You got a milkshake? Hell yeah. What what flavor? Yeah, what happened to these dudes? I gotta continue going under. I'm not seeing how I'm supposed to get over there. I'm trying to think my favorite flavor of milkshake. Probably cookies and cream. From Cold Stone? Heck yeah. I haven't had Cold Stone in a while. Yeah, it's always a good day when you <laughs> when you get a milkshake. It definitely makes it a day better. Ah, Thor's bridal circlet. This would be a gift worthy of Gunloda's attention. Man, there's so many freaking, like, those bridal bracelets or whatever in this game so far. Like, the Vikings must have been really about arm jewelry. <laughs> oh, you don't like the runny ones? I mean, I prefer it easy to drink, but yeah, I guess if it's like too melty, it is kind of nasty. There's a, there's definitely a sweet spot. All right, I think we're heading in towards the town now. We got the present. Now let's go to the party, huh? <laughs> I honestly, I'm not really sure what's going on <laughs> in the game right now. I don't think that's my fault. Let's my hood here. Uh, the game is just kind of, I don't know, hit or miss with uh, keeping you informed. Something about some ale that, or like some alcoholic drink, I think, that's supposed to uh, give you the knowledge, like all the knowledge in the universe. Some kind of like... Was that fruit? The forbidden fruit in the Garden of uh, Eden or whatever? Something like that. Yeah. The balance is key. I'm trying to think. There's some, um. You ever had. Is it Steak and Shake? I think it is Steak and Shake. They are my favorite shakes. I, I don't think I've ever seen it outside of Michigan, though. 
You, you're from Ohio, right? I think. If I remember correctly. So maybe there is some around there. But. I really. Oh, we're right next to this mystery. Can I go solve that mystery? Might as well. We're here. But yeah, steak and chicks nice because it's like I, it's almost cheaper than uh, McDonald's and stuff I think, but it's like way better quality. Definitely tastes better. Oh no! Yeah, their service is kind of hit or miss though. Like every single time I've gone in the past few years, uh, takes forever to get your food if you're if you sit down. But if you go drive through, it's not bad. But yeah, their shake machine was down, probably. <laughs> that sucks. It's worth another shot, though. They're pretty good. They have this crazy burger. It's like... Super garlicky. Yeah. Join me and I promise you victory! I heard you calling for a fighting partner. Two fight with two. That is the rule. But have no fear. You'll We're have to do but watch as Dugger the Bow destroys his foes. Either we're boxing or it's just a straight up like gladiator thing. Either way, I'm here for it. <laughs> yeah, I hope it I hope you have a better experience. Yeah, what, what about the scratch, What is my though? reward if I help you? Besides the glory of victory? Well, I have traveled far in this realm. I would be willing to share the location of some rare treasures. All right, fine. I unexpected fearsome opposition in the Jotna fighting pits. Fearsome, yes. Too fierce for you. But you can stand behind me. I'll deal with them single-handed. Oh, are we partnering up? Sure. I like your confidence, at least. I'll take this challenge. And you won't regret it. For Dugger the Bold is not only a great warrior, but a shapeshifter of peerless skill. Pick an animal. Any animal. I will take on that form in the combat to come. Ooh, what? Hell yeah. I mean, obviously, I'm going to go with the wolf. But what, 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 what uh, animal? Do you guys think we should go with anyone? The lynxes are pretty cool too. I don't see those a lot. But bears, I mean, literal tree trunks with knives on the end. Lynx? Alright. I have always found the lynx a swift opponent. Ah, you favor speed and agility over strength. A good choice. Now, for combat. That is true. Oh god, we're right into it. Okay. Okay, okay. What good is a rabbit? Wait. Did the motherfucker turn into a rabbit? And why? Oh, it, it is boxing. I gotta box a fucking bear? God damn it. Bear and a wolf. Because reasons, I suppose. Fuck out of here. I'm a god. <laughs> I think he just vetoed our decision anyways. That's unfortunate. What in hell's name was that? A rabbit. Did you hope to nipple your opponents to death? Uh, <laughs> and nibble well, them to death. By making myself seem feeble, I made them lower their guard. But All you ran away. Work for Duker the Bow. Are you even able to transform into a real beast? Of course I can. Anything I want. Um, I just don't want to right now. I'd better get some reward for carrying you in that fight. Or I'll stick your bobtailed arse in a stew. I found a note <laughs> on a dead traveler. It will lead you to treasures and secrets. At least, I hope it will. Yeah. Definitely put the team on our back there. 
Homie turned into a rabbit and Hippie hopped his way out of there. What an asshole. Is that all? Can we... I think the last one we did... We'd continually talk, but I guess that's it. That was fun. It's interesting. Alright, back to the main quest. This dude's house and give him this bracelet, I think, is what we're doing. Questionable gift for a man? You know. Gotta do what you gotta do. You're not a warrior till you've knocked someone's teeth down their throat! fighting pit the place where legends are made oh is he just talking about the fighting pit? I thought that there might be like some pop-up quest there or something there hasn't been any of those in this game you know maybe the Asir may have beaten us back at Asgard we just take a shortcut here maybe oh, okay we can't climb this this wall. Special wall. We can climb this one. I've been finding that. No sense trying to change fate. What counts is how you face it. Very hit or miss, like what, like things that look like they're climbable, but they're just not. And then just like sheer cliff faces, you can climb them. Holy fuck, that guy looks cool. Is this is this our man? Yo. I don't think he's gonna want a bracelet. You are small to my eyes, stranger. Small in stature, but great in deed. I am the one they call Javi, the High One of Asgard. And I come bearing a great gift. Your name is known to me, but what could mighty Sotunga want that a little thing like you could provide? Your great cauldron, stolen by Hemia's sons. Let this offering be a beginning to the end of our hostilities. Yeah, that Such little a small thing, yet thing is so like much deeper than it seems. In reality, can be deceiving. Like thirty times not? the size of what it is. Well spoken, Harvey. Our people may be enemies, but you have earned your welcome here. Thralls, an honored guest has come. Prepare a feast. I hope also to meet your daughter, Gunluther. I have heard much of her skill in the mystical arts. She will be toiling at her work, as ever. But be forewarned, she shuns the company of others. I could summon her to the feast, if you like. We might discuss matters of alchemy on the way. That would please me. You will find her in her grotto, up the path, Within the circle of stones. Have a care, though. You are safe in my presence, but you wander Utgard at your peril. I will be discreet. And Harvey, be kind. Gunnlother is different from you and I. Anyways, I didn't want to interrupt. Uh... Yeah, am I a big Assassin's Creed fan? Uh, I would say so. I mean, I'm not like an expert on the lore or anything. Uh, I definitely played the absolute crap out of the first one. I remember literally just like, I would try to like I'd attack a guard and I'd get all of them to try to attack me and I'd just sit there and just wait to counter. Like that was so fun, I do that for hours. Uh, I don't think I ever beat the first one, I just did that. <laughs> Back that I I just like to play games just for fun. Never really tried to complete them. Uh, and then I did similar things with most of the games. I played a lot of Odyssey, which I really like. I actually want to go back and play that eventually. Um, but I I got burnout in Odyssey. Just, I, it was my fault. <laughs> I was just doing all the like completion stuff. It's kind of trying to clear out the map before I moved on or whatever. Like all these little treasures and whatnot. But it, it's not really fun. It's kind of tedious, honestly. So uh, I think if I play that again, I'm just going to play it like I'm playing this. Just do the things that's fun. And yeah. 
yeah, I definitely really like Assassin's Creed. That is a good answer. But yeah, I do, I do miss the uh, the combat of the first games, first couple games. I just think it was so cool. Literally just a counter master. Like, I, I, you could you could just be really aggressive, but it was just so much easier to just like stand there and wait for someone to attack you. And they had some of the, like the coolest freaking like counter attacks. Like every single one was sp special for all the weapons. It was very cool. I, I might I might have to go back and play one of the older ones just to get that feeling again. If uh yeah, if Jake has a suggestion on which one, because maybe not the first one. So it probably didn't age that well, but what one has that kind of combat, but is like the most modern one? I know. Was it Brotherhood? Maybe. No. Unity. Unity was crazy. I didn't play a lot of that. Whoa! Fuck. But I think. I think Unity might have that combat style of just countering. I know it looks really nice. I saw some gameplay of it when I was starting this up. Like the graphics aged pretty well. Is there a faster way to get to where I'm going? Nah. I alerted the guards, didn't I? Come on. Nobody saw anything? No, you're not shooting an arrow at me. <laughs> Am I where I'm supposed to be? Assassin's Creed 2? Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Actually, let me put it on my list of games to play. If I do play that, it might just be by myself. Or on stream, but if it's on stream, it's gonna be uh, down the list of games. Let me see what I have here. So I really want to play uh, Dragon Age In Inquisition after this. I will be putting up this list on the Discord for people to vote on, like what they would want to see. Yeah, there's no promises. Like I'm gonna play whatever I feel like playing the most. That also has like. A good um, like I want to be in like the first three rows of uh, channels when you like search it up you know I want to be still be able to be discovered while playing a game I like basically that people want to see as well so I'm gonna be weighing that but uh, I would like to see what you guys would want me to play yeah right now I have uh, on this list Inquisition uh, Mass Effect Andromeda uh, I, I was talking about Odyssey, I want to play at some point. Horizon Zero Dawn. The Devil May Cry series. Never played those. Those seem fun. Uh, Bayonetta. Uh, Cyberpunk. I want to replay that. Um, Tiny Tina's eventually. Uh, and all the Witchers as well. Because I really liked The Witcher 3. Which this game reminds me a lot of actually. Which is pretty pog. But um, yeah. So Assassin's Creed 2 as well. Thank you for the suggestion. Yeah, Cyberpunk was awesome, honestly. I don't know... <laughs> I didn't understand all the hate it got. Like, yeah, it had some bugs, but nothing game-breaking. It was mostly just goofy shit, and I love it. Like, <laughs> I love all the... Especially as, like, a streamer and content creator. Like, it's just... The more... The more goofy a game is, the easier it is to make content for you. You just clip stuff, you know? <laughs> this game has been having a good amount of, like, 
kind of intended goofiness, which I love. But also some like weird seemingly glitches, but I don't know. I didn't even look at the objective. What are we doing? I hate this though in this game. It'll just be like, for instance, find this guy. The marker's on the map, but it doesn't show it on your compass. I don't know if that's intended or if it's a bug or what, but they don't give you any context clues on like where. Okay. I guess it does in the top corner if I read. Her grotto is within the stone circle. Stone circle. Stone circle. <laughs> That kind of looks like a circle. Like, yeah, I don't understand like what their fetish is with giving vague instructions on where to go. It's just kind of a waste of time and an annoyance. That's that's probably really the only uh, complaint I have with this game. So I'm gonna have to look this up now. So, I just do that. Been a lot of wikiing happening in this game. <laughs> uh, a feast to remember. Okay. Looks like this guy's going underground somewhere. Okay, there's some... So where the fuck is that? There's some, like, pit that I have to jump down, but I don't know where it's at. Okay, I kind of see... There's, like, some ice pillars around it. Oh, it's right here. Okay. I see. Back situated here. Question is, am I gonna have to open that? Because that was open for them in their little demonstration video. <laughs> the stone circle, but no way into the sanctum. Another illusion. Ah, it's an illusion. Okay. Uh, getting stuck in. Sometimes I get stuck with like my bow out and I don't know how to put it away. And then if you notice there when you jump and pull your bow out it goes slow-mo just on its own. Crap. So they didn't show how they got this to open up though. Or up here opened up I guess. Okay, something changed there. It was like, it like blurs, did you see that? The fuck is that about? Is it something with these pillars? I can't climb them, I don't think. <laughs> yeah, this, this area specifically is weird. Because somehow there's some sort of like switch I have to hit or I have to look at this correctly to get it to appear not close. Oh, is it this thing? There was one of these that like these little knobbies. So there was someone's house before 
that you, if you stood on it, it would open. Okay. Uh, it lo literally looked like the guy just ran over here and then turned back. Why? Like, wh how would I ever figure that out? Okay. Anyways, moving on. <laughs> Let me make sure I pause that video. I think I hear it playing in the background. Pull my torch out? Hello? Guess not. Gunluda, what is this place? Some time ago, we made powerful magic here. We sought to see all futures. But every road led to Ragnarok. Father does not visit here anymore. He sees no profit in it. But I am not yet ready to give up. You are Esir. I am. I have seen images of the future. Heard the voices of those who will come after us. Voices from in there? Yes. I leave them words. Little packets of possibility waiting for unknown ears many ages hence. Yeah, moving on. <laughs> there is to be a feast in my honor. Your father sent me to fetch you. No, not yet. Listen. I want you to hear the voices. I don't want to hear the voices Are in your head, lady. Prophet? Can you hear me? Perhaps another day. Another thread. Come. We must not keep father waiting. Things kind of creepy. Like a broken mirror or something. Who are you? Oh! Somebody came through! Winter's knife cuts deep and sky pearls fall thick in this land. It is cold out here. How can that surprise you? I haven't been outside in... Uh, I don't know how long. You are Same devoted lady. to your work. I haven't Not seen the sun in my responsibility. a while. <laughs> my people ignore the disaster bearing down on them. Someone must do something. We have long searched for a solution until the burden of it has bent my mind. I do not think as clearly as I once did. I've heard there's one method still untested. There is, but to activate it would mean defiling our well of knowledge, from which all of Midgard drinks. There is no telling the change it would wreak on humankind. It would bring chaos at the least, and I do not wish to hurt them. Even if it means the death of all Jotna? We will find another way. We must. This land is quite beautiful. I had all but forgotten. It is very pretty. Gotta say. Yeah, so far, um... My favorite parts of this game have definitely been the... Uh, like, you go to Asgard, and then Jotunheim, but it's kind of a ways into the game. I think I'm maybe like 
20 Such hours in or something. <laughs> great harm in the hands of evil people. I, I've done... I think I'm on part... No stone walls will defend us 14 rock comes. in my playthrough on YouTube. Have built here will be um, swept away. And I play like two hours usually. So, I don't know, math. <laughs> something. I'm a ways in. But yeah... It doesn't- that doesn't mean, like, the Viking part isn't fun, it's just... It ha this has so much more to it, you know? For so I'm such a fantasy fan. There in that tower. Enchantment has seeped into its very walls. This just looks dope as fuck. The wind fuck. and snow have gnawed that tower to the bone. Soon, we will knock it down. Whoa, like, this is so cool. Heck yeah. Yeah, uh, I kind of just mentioned, but if you guys are watching on YouTube, uh, thank you very much. Uh, if you could leave a like if you enjoyed the video, it really helps to get shown to a lot of people. And uh, yeah, you could also come out and watch me live. Your feast is prepared. Thursdays, Fridays, and you are generous and hospitable indeed. Sundays, 8 p.m. EST. Would love to have you. None can say otherwise. And see, your gift stands in pride of place. Brimming with freshly fermented mead. Enough for a hundred Thank you, every, everyone that's here right now. Y'all freaking this rock. This is an unexpected honor. You have filled it already with mead from your vault, then? No need. It has filled itself. Such is the magic of the cauldron. Impressive. But what if it should run out of mead? Do you hear this? Harvey fears he will drink us dry. <laughs> my cauldron is deep, but my vault is deeper. Do not worry about my stores of mead. I have plenty to go around. Father, you know revelry does not suit me. Must I attend this feast? I have work to do. Your work can wait, my daughter. Take a moment, enjoy yourself. Father, we have very little time. Enjoy yourself. I insist. Harvey, the guests are uneasy. They see an Aesir, but they do not know you. Will you address them? I'm ready. Now, we will hear from our honored <coughs> mm, speech has come in peace and brought us a I was unprepared. Attend. Oh god. Yatnar? I don't know what that means, but we are definitely a warrior. Harvey, I'm cold, whose axe is never slaked. The blood of my enemies is my meat. Their skulls, my pillow. You brag well. They were ever pleased by violence. I almost drank my shake with the cap still, like the little film thing still on. <laughs> I thought I took it off. Usually I do. Stand humble in your presence. Great Yatna, I stand here in awe of your might and majesty. They do not respect weakness. Show some backbone. Oh, okay. Let me sing a song. That's so hard. Ah, fuck it. Let's just get drunk. <laughs> I could go on, but who wants to hear words when there's meat and meat to be had? I well, like that. <laughs> know your audience well, it seems. Now we will drink deep and eat heartily. 
Let the feast begin. Cheers, my blue people. The guests are not drinking fast enough. Perhaps I can speed things along. Are we poisoning them? Is that the is that the goal? You see musicians. Where is the music? Somber souls will only sip at their drinking horns. Conjure us a tune to raise their spirits. We are keen, but my harp has been stolen. We cannot play without it. Who would steal a songbringer's instrument? There was a group of children playing round us earlier, with mischief in their eyes. I will get your harp back, and then you will play. Thralls. Humans kept in bondage, bred to serve. Such is the fate of the lowly. No guests in the kitchen! Out! Oh, all right. <clears throat> they are calling for challengers to face their champion. A fight would help them drain their caps. Sure. Abby, a bit of a scrap. Mate. Beat our champion and we will drain our horns in your honor. Bring me this champion and I will shine my knuckles on his jawbone. Behold! Do not mock me. I will not fight a withered old crone. <laughs> If you are too afraid to face her, well, that is that. It's probably going to turn into a fucking dragon or something. If she is truly your champion, then so be it. I will try not to break her brittle bones, but I promise nothing. Who will challenge a champion? That's a wild technique. Oh my god. Lady. Is she too strong for you? Negative. Can you not beat an old woman? Just kick her right, right in the cooch. Indeed, you are mighty. You have fought old age and won. No one has ever done that before. Drink to me then, as you promised you would. All of you, empty your horns for heavy. The mead is half gone. Then Aegir's cauldron can be drained. They beat the champion. Nobody's ever beaten the champion. Drink in the name of Abby! Ah yes, this is the cauldron that was in our hand. I want to go! Get second ago. Can we jump in there? My turn! I kinda wanna try. I wonder what happens. Hellbunga! Drink me, people. Yeah. <laughs> Probably smell terrible now. <laughs> nice. Of course you get drunk. That's that's a good, that's a nice touch. Hold on. That harp does not belong to you, little thief. You should give it back. What are you gonna do? Fight me for it? Why don't you give me a real challenge? All right. You want this harp? Go dive in that meat. Climb as high as you can, though. I want a big splash. Watch and learn. <laughs> oh, she wants a cannonball. So you're meant to jump in it. Got it. Do you think? Fifty at least. Maybe a hundred. <laughs> We're gonna die of alcohol poisoning just through osmosis, I think. I can fly, y'all didn't know. There. Now give back the harp so the musicians may play. Umius, hairy balls! That was amazing! You must be half raven! Who taught you such language? Yeah. Mother? Why? I need to empty uh, my mom. She is a, in his vault. She swears like a sailor, so questionable parenting. Gotta say. I should try the archery contest. No doubt they will toast my prowess if I succeed. 
Oh, heck yeah. Don't mind if I do. Greetings, Harvey. Will you test your arm at archery? You must hit three targets in a handful of heartbeats. I can shoot the wings of a wasp. Ah, but can you do it while mead adult? Before each attempt, you must take a drink. I'll take your challenge on one condition. For every drink I take, you take two. Ha! <laughs> That's a condition I'll gladly accept. Are you ready? I think so. Let's give her Show a shot. Show me those targets. Then take a drink and let fly. Where are the targets at? I would like to know. Close your eyes, your luck will improve. Oh, I see, I see. Okay, let's try that again. You look a bit wobbly. Fine shot. Now, have a drink and try another. It's like a quick draw kind of thing. You look a bit wobbly. Steady eye now. The last one is the hardest. You look a bit wobbly, eh? Got it. You are a keen shot, Harvey. Your hand grows steadier with drink, where others lose their eye. Another round? Not for me. Look at me. My belly roids Steady. like a knot of eels. <laughs> and I see three of you. I think I should walk this off. Hegir's cauldron has come to Utgader. Is there any... Agir, mighty friend to the Asir. Are you not sorry to lose your cauldron? It was never mine by right. Thor won it from Humir so he might feast in my hall. I only kept it on his behalf. And after that bloody business with Humir's sons, well, I'd as soon be rid of it. I'll have no strife beneath my roof. The end of strife. I'll drink to that. And I'll drink to anything. Is there any sweeter music than the clash of drinking horns? Is that Loki there? Surely he would not dare. Definitely his getup. Loki? Not me, friend. My name is Thok. Uh, forgive me. I, I thought you were someone else. Too much drink in too little time. The cure for that is sleep. What can I do to get them to drink faster? Gunloda looks glum, and she has not touched a drop of mead. You are not drinking, Gunloda. I do not care for it. Drink is the heron that steals away one's memory. Some would say it frees the spirit of worry. We call those people drunks. <laughs> I see your wit is as sharp as your intelligence. Wit? I was simply stating a truth. Let us play a game. Ask me some riddles. I will see if I can guess them. I enjoy a good riddle. How did you know? All great minds enjoy riddles. You fashion order from disorder, sense from nonsense. You have me at that. Very well, I will play. Give me an easy one to begin. Would that I had now what I had yesterday. Find out what that was. Mankind it mars, speech it hinders, yet speech it will inspire. Oh god, riddles. Help. Send help. Uh Yeah, I wasn't Could you ready give for it that. To me again? Would that I had now what I had yesterday. Find out what that was. Mankind it mars, speech it hinders, yet speech it will inspire. Speech it will inspire. Probably the ale. How is a betten man? It is ale, of course. A child could have solved that one. Would you like another? Fuck you! No! <laughs> I have changed my mind. Riddles bore me. Did I do something wrong? Enjoy the feast. You insulted my intelligence. I should tell Sutunga. But. <laughs> Admittedly, I'm not very good at riddles. <laughs> So I'm just moving on. 
Great Sutunger, your guests thirst for mead, yet the cauldron is dry. All gone? I never would have thought it possible. Granola? Father? Open the vault. Instruct the thralls to bring more mead for my guests. Do they really need more, Father? Several are unconscious already. Do as I ask, daughter. Give them all they can drink. As you wish. I will open the vault. None will say that Sutunger is less than generous. None will be capable. <laughs> They'll all be dead. Pretty sure we're poisoning everyone. Could be wrong. Okay. Um, I guess this this looks like what we're supposed to do. Yeah, that's a, that's a tip. For a little freebie for anyone wanting to play this game. Or any game, really. Zip lines definitely point you in the direction of where you're supposed to go. Same as, like, enemies. If there's enemies somewhere and there's some... Finally, the vault is open. The mead awaits within. There's, a uh, Not enemies at the other entrance or whatever. Definitely go towards the enemies. So there's a reason that... There's a reason that the developers put them there, you know? Everything is usually thought out. For the most part. Definitely with plot holes and stuff, but... Not usually with enemies. But sometimes... Sometimes you can tell when things are built up more, you know? What are you doing here? More decorated and stuff. Ooh, we can romance? I mean, sure, I'm not seeing anyone. <laughs> I just had to see you. Fate, Gunlotha. We are helpless to escape it. And we were fated to be here now, together. You and I? How? It makes no sense. The Nordnir spin their patterns, and we can only surrender. We are entwined, spun together. There's perfect sense in that. Hmm. <laughs> Step on me, you giantess. No, you tease <laughs> and mock, but I do not believe your lies. Your only desire is the mead. You are a thief and an agent of chaos. I'll see hmm? you pay for this deceit. Guards! She just can't stand someone. You know what? She's got some issues, all right? She can't stand someone complimenting her. Fuck you. I didn't mean to th <laughs> didn't mean to throw that. Fuck. Fuck, fuck. He's got me. He's got me pinned. Ah, fuck. You bastard kicking dirt at me. Fuck you. do this. You cannot know the consequences. No one can. Okay, what are we doing now? She's just I feel bad. Got her like cornered in a room. I just gotta search for the mead now, I guess. Do I talk to her? Is there a talk button? No. They had her marked, I was just wondering. I'm not trying to bother her anymore. She seems nice. Just troubled, you know. Uh... <laughs> oh, I see some. <laughs> ah, the mead. Behold. 
The mead, by this strange magic, might the Aesir evade our doom. Hirkin has promised answers at the well of Mimir. I've gotten what we came for. I gotta go to a well. Def definitely fast traveling. It's not available. Cool, cool, cool. Maybe we, we just, just gotta get out of here. Out from underground and then we can fast travel. I was gonna say, I don't remember how we got in, but I see, see the light. Also, light really guides Harvey, there. where you're supposed to go in games. Betrayer! Deceiver! I treated you as an honored guest, and this is how you repay me? I saw you at the feast, Loki. Small wonder you disguised yourself after all you have done. Someone needed to warn my people of the treachery in your heart. Suttungor, show this Aesir how the Jotnar deal with thieves. Fuck, that sword is cool. Do I get Embrace that? Embrace your death! What have you done with my daughter? He's got so much help. Holy fuck. It's gonna be an issue, isn't it? Fuck. Dang, I'm getting... Goddamn... Rained on. What am I supposed to do about that? Other than just endure it, I guess. Okay, we're out of arrows. Get out of this. Yeah, get out of it, but like ow. Is the strength in your arm fading? What is this thing doing? Is it giving me health? Some sometimes, at least most of the boss battles. Oh, that did give me health. Oh, I see, I see. These are uh, safe areas. Nice, we got him to the next I stage, at least. Too long to suffer one such as you. Your bones will splinter beneath my boots. With uncountable lives. Kind of. I wonder if this is only on this level of difficulty, because this <laughs> feels a little like. Is he? Oh god! What have you done with I, my I'm stuck inside you. I, I don't like this. <laughs> oh, I see. There's only certain ones that are going to be available now. Shit! Farted and shit. No. <laughs> Fuck, he's so fast. We got him. Now that I know what's going on. Gotta look out for these. Cause this stuff seemingly can't hit us in here, yeah. Even like all that craziness going on. <laughs> Aside from his actual melee attacks, this is like hollowed ground or something. And get in some swings. Let me out of your skirt. I don't like this. Fuck you. Yeah. 
He clearly doesn't know what's going on because he tried to do that little like shockwave. Oh shit, we're climbing him like a tree. <laughs> the animation was fucking janked. Be thankful it was me who took your meat and not Loki. What I do, I do for the safety of the Aesir and Vaniat. You will change countless fates, Harvey, but not your own. We will see. Hidekin said to find her at Mimi as well. I will deal with this venomous trickster another day. Hmm. I guess... We'll deal with him another day. I don't think we can kill him. I'm gonna try in a second. I'm gonna save. Just cause, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't like him, so, yeah. Really wanted to get these cause uh, we can reuse arrows. Oh. What? Do I have enough to just go to all of them? All of it there? Anyways, so I want to finish this out. How much higher does this tree go? I think this is melee things. What? What does this say? The light bell. I don't know if we want that. Yeah, I think that's going more to melee, which we will do, but I want to finish out getting all the useful... Okay, this has, like, headshot damage. Yeah, we'll try to get to that. I can't acquire... I guess they're not connect. Oh, okay. We gotta go this way. <laughs> we'll try to get the head headshot damage there. I want to finish out ranged and then go melee. Oh, that's right. I wanted to save and try to kill this dude. So just, you know, don't seem right. Ah, we can't. Boo. Right, let's fast travel over here. Mmm, fuck. Should have got that other fast travel point so we could come back to the town faster. I was literally thinking about that as I was clicking it. Mm. Oh, well. Come to me, my steed. Go! Oh, so. I was watching some some crazy shit before stream. Uh, I had never. Th it was just a vi YouTube video that got the suggested to me. The world tree Yggdrasil feed from the well of Mimir. I am close. Um, but it was about how does internet get? How, like, how does it go across oceans? And literally, it's big ass cables, like as big as these roots here. <laughs> it's fucking crazy, and it's like under. They're un like all under the ocean, under the ocean, on like the fl the floor of the ocean, just like going all over the world. It's pretty, I sorely underestimated the heft of your balls, Oathbreaker. You dare show your face, Oathbreaker? I did to you what you did to my son. This is only fair. And Sutunga, what of him? 
His son endangered everyone. Don't blame me for your own lack of character. You stole the mead. For the safety of my people, Loki. For Asir, for Vanir, for all of Asgard. But not for Jotnar. Not for me. You let the Jotnar into Asgard. So many dead, all so you could smuggle in your son. He was not safe here. They knew what he was and knew what he would become. Just as you do. I swore to you I would not harm him. That is the truth. That is the truth now. But how it will gnaw at you, knowing that to kill my son will undo your doom. Release him, Harvey. Release Fenrir, or I swear I will kill you. Here and now. You are out of favors, Trickster. And you are welcome to try. Oh shit, I wasn't... I was not ready. Fuck, I have no arrows or anything. I will feed your corpse to Fenrir. Good thing. I was gonna say this in the last boss fight, but no quarter this time, Loki. You have gone too far. They have it set up. It's like all these fights are in these arenas, and you can. Fuck. When you can die now. If someone's not teleporting <laughs> and stabbing you, you can usually <clears throat> run a circle Curse you, Loki. and fill up on arrows that are placed like all around. Okay, I think that's about a full circle. Wait for him to get out of his bubble like a little bitch. Shit. Let's see if you fight as well as you lie. So fucking fast. You might wow. be the strongest, but I was ever the quickest. I can't imagine this on another difficulty. Like I'm garbage. Whoa. You meant to have me killed! I will never forgive that. What? Why did I melee attack? I was still still on my bow out. Oh, because I'm out of see if you fight as well as you lie. Fuck. And ah. fuck you. And should we You might be the strongest. I think we should try to give him some poison. Oh, what? It put that on my weapon? I didn't want that. This time, Loki. If anything, I wanted it on my... Far. Good to know. Maybe it'll go on my arrows as well. Oh. Shit. Yo, unfair. Stop it. Alright. Collection phase. Wait, did we not get it? You meant to have me killed! I will never forgive that. Leave me alone. I'm not ready, Loki. Curse you, Loki. We were like brothers once. Looks like I've... Yeah, I definitely gathered up all the arrows allotted to me. That's right. This dude cheats. For real. I don't think you're supposed to be able to kill him. Let's see if you fight as well as you lie. Something weird's gonna happen. God damn it. Alright, we're gonna try to the rest of this with melee, because I think we ran out of arrows. Fuck. You meant to have me killed! I will never forgive that. Alright. Just light attacks. You might be the strongest Name of the game here, because he's so the one. How the fuck are you supposed to hit him? Maybe a faster weapon. No quarter this time, Loki! You have gone too far! I will feed your corpse to Fenrir. Curse you, Shit, Loki! Man. We were like brothers once! Jesus! I think actually, you know what? I was talking about liking counter combat. I think that's what this is supposed to be, maybe. So he's so fast, you just gotta wait and be able to counter him. He's like coming in out of my field of view and shit. What the fuck? No quarter this time, Loki! 
You have gone too far! Yes, did we get him? Hell yeah. God, he's annoying. You can die now. Fucking Christ. Are you finished? Sorry. Curse you, Harvey. Your own distrust has undone you. Now go. And do not show your face again. I cannot be other than who I am. All this was fated. All this will happen again. But you will not be here to see it. Do not be so sure of that. The game is not over. The game is never over! <laughs> and he's a fish? Okay. On. Fucking so coward. Knows what mischief. But I will not see him again soon. Soon enough. Try to fill back up my health because I know that there's a, a circle full of health here. Oh right, he closed it off, but still, around this lake, there's a bunch of food. Mm, I feel stronger already. Nice. Okay, where to? Reach the well. It says it's this way. Just can't see it on the map, I guess. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, the reindeer doesn't yeah. want to go in there. I was like, why is it violently pulling to the <laughs> to the sides? We weren't respecting its boundaries, I guess. It's scared of the indoors. Makes sense. It's too big. That's a face. You're right. Abilities lead us here. The calculations give us hope. Speaking with someone? Do you have the mead? I do. Must I drink it now? Not yet. For once you drink, your hugur will take flight and be ever fixed. Drink only when the hour of your death approaches. My what? Then why are we here? When Ragnarok has come and gone, this place will remain. Remain. And remember. Wise Mimir, keeper of the well, give me your counsel. You who Is this seek God? immortality may find it within these waters. But there is a price. As always. The mead is not magic alone. It requires the sacred waters of Mimir's well to ferment into its final state. Before you take these waters, you must infuse them with the blood of the Asa. To remember you, it must know you. Surrender a part of yourself to the waters that nourish the world tree. Only then will you have that which you desire. Yeah, what's gonna happen to Midgard? Gunlur the wand of chaos and change. I would know the cost. Azir blood will infuse this water, and the poor humans of Midgard will be forever altered. What happens then? None can say. This is what the others feared, but then they always cared over much for vermin. And if I make this sacrifice, what then? While death and ruin rage all around, the world tree will keep you. Your body will die, but your hugur will live on here. Hugur is like a spirit, maybe? You will be born anew, into a new world birthed from the ashes of the old. Do you vouch for this strangeness? I must believe it. 
Or there is one I love dearly who depends upon it. And there is no other way. None. It seems I have no choice. You never did. How much would you sacrifice to be freed of fate's shackles? Would you give your tongue, your hand, your sight? I would give all that and more. Freaky shit's happening. Very red eye. Oh, we're holding it. Oh, it's our. He pulled his eye out. Okay. It is done. Javi fucking strong, not even reacting to his eye being pulled out. Whosoever drinks of the meat, the fucking Giga Chad over here. Them. And you, what is your sacrifice? My liberty. Sutungar and Gunlother will not forgive this trespass. They will hunt me now to the edges of the Nine Worlds. What are they to you? We ruled together for a time, a noble triad, as father, mother, and the sacred voice. Six times we tried to blunt the fangs of Ragnarok, and six times we failed. The mead was our seventh. But they feared how it might change the humans for the worse, so they locked it away and banished me from Utgardr. By your efforts, you have returned to me what is mine. The ashes of my husband. He made his own sacrifice for knowledge. With a few changes to this mead, I may undo old sorrows. Do as you will. I've had my fill of this cursed realm. Bright mind, heart's ease. Beloved, I will not fail you again. No, oh, don't send me back to the real world. My work Just having done. some fun. Now to ask God to save my people. All right, I'm going to run an ad so that we turn them off for people coming in. Uh, and I'm going to use the bathroom real fast. I'll be right back.
All right, we are back. Yeah, nice and comfy. Now, what are we doing? Oh, it's time to wake up. Okay. I suppose. Hmm. It's gonna say that underwater internet <laughs> stuff reminded me that I was watching this other show. It's like a spy show. Come. Settle your mind and tell me what you have seen. Strange things, Valka. I'm learning much and seeing more than my mind can understand. Go on. In Jotunheim, I sought and found a meat of incredible power. It promised me a strange effect. To drink it would deliver me from death, shield me from the destruction of Ragnarok. By this meat, I hope to live beyond my own death, well into the future. Fascinating. Was that your final vision? They have not ended, not yet. Something compels me to return to Asgard. The elixir is ready when you are. Yeah, because it's fun. It's cool. I am ready. Anyways, I was watching this like... It's like a spy tech explanation type show and there's a I guess there's technology that they use lasers and you can like point this laser through a window and somehow some something like fr from the light that ret is returned to the laser they can uh, record audio from a laser beam like what the fuck crazy shit so don't be trying to get away from the don't be trying to get away from the CIA or anything because <laughs> they'll get you <laughs> the fucking laser beam be the cord is forged Gleipnir I call it I'll wager there's a good story behind that wound a tale for another time thank you for this when you bind the beast, spare no loose ends. The cord will stretch or shrink to fit your needs. How tightly will it hold? The beast may resist. The more you tighten the cord, the stronger it will hold and the greater it will hurt. Till the beast is rooted to the ground. Thank you, Ivaldi. You may go. He's not ready. <laughs> My debt to you is paid in full? Yes, as promised. Thank you, Harvey. I, uh, I did not expect you to remember. Where will you go next? Under the mountains of Svartalfheim. Our mountains. To free the Earth's riches. For this is what I know best. As any dwarf should. What a wholesome moment. Okay, we have the world's strongest chain. Let's go catch us a doggy. Let's do a fast travel. Like in between. In between the island we need to get to. And then portal from our throne. Ah, yes. And today's question of the day is, uh, did anyone go to summer camps as a kid? And what, uh, like, do you have any fun uh, memories? Like any funny stories or anything like that from from summer camps of old huh? 
this is a really long zip line. I was in Boy Scouts, so <laughs> I was blessed enough to uh, get to go on a bunch of bunch of adventures every summer. Oh, we got some points. I did. I forgot. Let's put those in. Yeah, we wanted to get to this, I think. I don't really need the poison or whatever. Just need this. Okay. Almost there. Yeah, I don't think I have any that I can think of. Yeah, you know, extensive stories or anything, but we got to do all kinds of cool stuff like shoot arrows, um had did a shotgun merit badge, which is pretty dope. I guess that is <laughs> that's kind of a story. Uh, when I was doing that shotgun merit ba merit badge for whatever reason, uh, well, and I, I know I now know why because of kids like me. They would only load your shotgun with one shell at a time, and for whatever reason. Because we were shooting at clay pigeons. For whatever reason, I didn't... I didn't shoot. Like, I told, totally just, like, scanned. Like, I was just aiming at one of the pigeons as it flew by, and I didn't didn't think I was lined up right, so I didn't, I didn't shoot. And for whatever reason, I just really needed to get that... <laughs> just really needed to fire that off. For some... I just needed something in me was like, get this bullet out of this fucking gun. So, and I asked the instructor, I remember Jean, asking him. Are you near? I was like, Sh should I just shoot this off? Like what? Like I, it what didn't occur to me to just wait for the next <laughs> clay to go up, go up for whatever reason. And I was like, yeah, should I just shoot this off like at the ground or something? And I think he, didn't hear me say, like, at the ground? <laughs> he just thought I meant, like, should I shoot this off on the next pigeon? And he, but he said yes, and I just popped that shit into the, <laughs> into the ground, like, not, not really close to us, but decently, you know, at the ground, and everyone freaked out. They shut down the range and sat me down, and we talked about it. <laughs> Hmm. Harvey, you're a balm to my eyes. What happened to yours? A sacrifice for something greater. Is the wolf nearby? Yes, but he's grown. I have kept him company, but he's consumed by a sadness I cannot understand. Regrettable, but necessary. I knew from the start this wolf brought ill tidings. From the start it was a kind creature. But our mistrust and cruelty have robbed the poor wolf of its sweetness and life. Would it be a kindness to kill it then? We are past the time for such mercy. This wolf has power now that would test our strengths combined. I fear he is possessed of a power that renders him ever living. Then we will offer him a different fate. This cord is unbreakable. You must convince him to wear it. It will act as a leash whose magic will signal that he is safely secured. An assurance to the Aesir who fear him. A beacon, that is all. No harm will befall the poor Fenrir. Fenrir, yes. You know the creature's name. Did Loki tell you? Yes. He did. It is a fine name. Yes, Dweller of the Fence. An apt name for his current fate. Dweller of the Fens, is that what he said? I'm not sure what a Fen is. Henry! A good word has come! Leave me. Ooh. I wish you well, Great Wolf. But a fear still hangs over Asgard. The Aesir worry. About your growing size and strength. Do they now? He looks fucking cool as shit. A 
And what do they have to be afraid of? Dude, look at yourself. <laughs> Harvey brings a collar fashioned by the dwarves. A beacon that we may track from a distance to know where you roam. Wear this and you may live and thrive in Asgard without worry. I smell something sour. Wear the collar. Or return to Jotunheimer. There's no third way. Son of Loki. Have I not treated you with kindness? We are bonded, you and I. And as I trust my king, so you may This trust. snoot is so long. Open your mouth. As a pledge of faith, you may take my hand if I am untrue. Fair. Hmm? Be swift, Harvey. I think he's just straight up sacrifice, sacrificing his hand because he's going to get pissed. Yeah, look, look at him. He's ready. It burns. Harvey? Nice. Unbind him! Uh, <laughs> Harvey! Here you stay! Fendweller. Fuck. <laughs> Here you die. Deceiver. Brothers will fight Shit. one another. Kill one another. You speak in riddles. The home of the gods turns around. Yeah, he was hard enough to fight the last time. And he wasn't giant. All right, collection phase. Okay, at least there's a shit ton of uh, arrows, seemingly. Even though it didn't seem like it did much damage to. <laughs> Need to find his weak spot. Shoot that. Whoa! He's so fast. Holy shit. Why is everything so fast in this game? Alright. His legs. Makes sense. Yeah, this isn't doing any Okay, the the weak spot's doing damage. Barely any, though. That does nothing. What the fuck? Okay. What about... Hmm. This is gonna be a really long fight. I feel like I'm not upgraded enough for this or something. But, it seems like the... arrows are respawning. So we'll just ring around the rosy over and over. Okay, he's sliding, he's sliding. What the fuck was that? Alright. Yeah, this is doing like no fucking damage at all. Oh, am I supposed to just, like, get on him or something? Is that... No, I'm just really weak. But my my bow is doing absolutely no damage, so we gotta... Oh, fuck. So we gotta try to whittle him down here. Mm. 
to watch my stamina. How is this doing no damage? That sucks. What about this one? Oh, it did. Okay. Two also does damage. I think two is a little bit better to use here. What about three? Maybe get some poison. Luckily, he doesn't seem to be attacking me that much. Although I am in the sweet spot of these kind of bosses, like right on the hip. We just gotta run, I think. Just need to sprint when he's fucking... Yeah, it doesn't matter. Maybe we have to roll to try to get out of that? Come here, bitch. Take this poison. I'm like hitting the wrong shit. Really need to. I wish. I swear the key but Oh, what? I didn't even have to be near him to do the two adrenaline thing. It just like launches me at him. Kind of dope. Oh, what? New Where did you hear these words phase of the of fight? Prophecy? Okay, I gotta be somewhat close. Oh, what the fuck he's using a using a goddamn log or something? We did earn a bunch of arrows somehow. No, it kinda seems like a waste of time. Yeah, we just, we just gotta evade when he pops out, I think. Okay. Run away from that. Okay, these are doing more damage now, for whatever reason. And apparent- oh shit. Apparently- Oops. We earn back... Arrows? Maybe we were just walking over them, just happened to. Making a fucking tornado? Alright. Out of arrows. But yeah, we earn them as we fight, I guess? That's what it seems like. I don't know why I did that again. Doesn't seem to work, work very well. Alright, just wait. <laughs> Nice, we got it again. This might be the like most epic boss fight I've ever done, guys, so <laughs> Oh shit. Need to pay attention to my health, he almost got us. Doing a good job though. If I don't say so myself. Bind him! 
Then comes the second great sorrow, when the Harvey goes to fight the wolf. How do you know these things? This is the tale I tell myself, each night in the cold and dark, before I sleep and dream of taking your flesh. But yeah, I, I don't usually play Dark Souls-y like games, but this is definitely Dark Souls-esque, right? I mean, not as uh, delayed, which is why I usually never even... I tried Dark Souls once and the wind-up on the attacks are so long. Just nope, not a fan. Could not. Especially how hard the game is, you know? This is pretty cool. Ooh, if you chain him, you, you, it does launch you further, it seems. I don't know why I wasn't doing that before. Okay, tornado time. We're out of adrenaline. Oops. I was smashing my two to chop them. Wasn't wasn't doing it. Keep hitting. What is that? F1. An accident. Yeah. <laughs> Showing my FPS. <laughs> Wrong button again. Yeah, I don't know what else to bind my abilities to. So you have to have separate ones for both of your ranged and uh, melee, I believe. We almost got him, though. So yeah, I would like to put all of my abilities on my mouse. That's how I usually play MMOs, which is... Should be kind of like, but... It's just not. Maybe I'll look at that after this fight, because... That would really help. Yeah, I don't think this is how this is supposed to go. Gotcha, bitch. <laughs> Alright, hold on. Yeah, let me see. I know it's been a while. Let's see if I can't bind this better, because it's... Really getting annoying. Where is it? Yeah. So I have four abilities. For whatever reason. Oh, I think it's because usually I have shift shift to sprint. But in this game, it's dodge. Maybe control needs to be... No, but control is sneak. I think that's the whole reason, and then... Obviously, you need jump in this. Just space bar. Maybe, like, Q, E... F and R? F focuses the camera, which I don't use that much. R is the regional panel. That is four buttons. Maybe we'll do that. 
They'll probably yell at us, but it's been yelling at us the whole time. So, so Q, E, R, and F. Let me try that. Definitely be a lot more comfortable and I don't have to like look over because every single time I gotta like look over and the number buttons are not a normal thing to do that with. Okay, yeah, so it is... That would have helped so much. <laughs> Should have done that way earlier. Nice. So, actually, let me rearrange these as well. Let me save, too. So, I don't think I have them set up ideally. No, abilities. So yeah, I'd probably want poison first for bosses. Yeah, I want to set this up for bosses, I think. So, yeah, this would be really good on Q. This one definitely lasts, so it's, what? The last one's F, I think. Oops. R. We don't have anything. We don't have a fourth one yet. We'll see. The second one lights people on fire. Can we use any of these other ones as well? The raven fucker... Distracts enemies? I don't really understand what that one does. It like slows time, maybe? This one puts people to sleep. I guess we can take this one and we'll put it on F as the last one, and then we'll go for this. So we poison, burn them, and then this can shoot through walls. And then if we need... We'll put poison in the same spot so we don't get confused. And then... This one is like ranged, which is pretty good. You, most of the time. It didn't work in that last fight because it's just... Very specific. You could only attack his like knees. That one's weird. This one's also kind of weird. Yeah, we'll do this. Probably never gonna use these. Yeah, we'll just we'll just leave that one blank. No reason to slot it if we're not not gonna use it. I just don't think that those other abilities would do damage. Is the issue? So I think I tried one. I can't remember which, and it didn't do anything. And I was like, "Well, I could not strike the killing blow. Wasted my All adrenaline." All oaths remain unbroken. Anyone lesser would have succumbed to his hatred. If I could have done this any other way. There was no other way, Harvey. Our fates are fixed. Fate, I know. You made a great sacrifice on my behalf. It was not for you. Think your kindness has made you a new friend, Lord of Imbeciles. I will kill you, all of you. Dude, he's such a badass fuck. Flesh. You may strike the final blow, son of Loki, but I will savor my years of freedom before we meet again. Come, old friend. The healing hands of Freya can help you. <laughs> they animated his face really well because as soon as we walk away he just like looks away and he's like fuck 
just really setting in I mean, that he's stuck. He can't he can't get out. Have you come to say what I fear? Not to say, but to show a vision of the times to come. None living or dead now equal our heavy in arrogance. To believe that you could remake your fate thus. For all your efforts, for all your struggles, the threads of fate still what bind What the aquatic fuck is going on? And yet, from this pattern, a single strand escapes the fray and stubbornly clings to the weave. Esir, Vanir, your doom will come. The earth will shake, the sun will die. Jötnar will stalk your streets as fire rains upon your heads. And the great wolf Fenrir will feast upon your blood. But you have found a way to live beyond this It's kind of like a jump scare, I appreciate that. Cheat your death. From the life tree we go, to the life tree we shall one day return. Mind and spirit will search to a time far beyond your own. To a time in which you shall be reborn. None may follow. Loki least of all. So he looks different there, so... Eivor isn't Javi, or... It is done. Odin, time to I think. Face our end. Who he is, actually. He's just like embodying him or some weird lineage connection happening. Hopefully my game didn't bug out. Looked like he was talking there when he woke up, but no sound came out. My camera is all messed up. My day to die. Here we go. Got audio still? I believe, anyway. Let me know if not. Okay, what are we doing now? Settlement to four. Members of the order. Contracts. River raids. Uh, I'd ra <laughs> God, I don't. <laughs> I really don't want to do those. So to continue, we gotta get to power two, two, one. What are we at right now? Where does it say that? Oh wow, we gotta grind a bit, huh? Okay. So it says the other quest we have is contracts. Killing these members of the order. I don't know if raising the settlement level will increase our power. So we'll head back to... we'll wake up. So I don't think you can upgrade in here. Maybe we'll get another quest when we wake up too. Anyways, we'll upgrade our armor and stuff as much as we can and see what kind of power level we get to. I think I'm also going to try to sell what equipment I have right now that I'm not using, that is. Eivor, you have awakened. With more to share, I hope. I return to Asgard. And what did you see? I bound, I bound the wolf, the wolf. Loki's son with an unbreakable cord. 
The beast was enraged by my actions. We fought and I prevailed, but I could not kill the beast. You visit lore and legend. Things I would never have imagined to be real. Parables, yet here you live them as memories. Every moment there was as tactile and as vital as you and I seated in this hut. This is wonderful. Was there more? Hmm. Yeah, I feel like this is some inf info she would need. Like, I didn't do this, but Javi did. That was a, a betrayal. I betrayed my friend Tyr. I stood by as the great wolf mauled him, tearing his arm off at the joint. I could have said something to prevent it, given him a warning. But I did nothing. How did it feel? I was unmoved by his pain. Not hateful, but I did not regret my indifference. A swig of poison that drinks like wine. Selfishness unmeasured often feels this way. What else did you see? Yes, we saw Ragnarok. I witnessed the final vision from the Nornir. The coming of Ragnarok. All was fire and ash. A chaos like a foul wind from the depths of Ginungagap. But we were ready for the coming storm. Eight of us, we drank the mead, then stood and marched to our doom. And that was the end of the Nortnir's prophecy. How? Did you move my pot? I did. Greetings. I did. Word of our growing settlement has reached outside ears. So have a look around. You may see a few new faces. I want to see the Alliance map. Yeah, it looks like we can go... Ooh, I didn't realize we hadn't gone to East Anglia yet. I was actually stationed in Mildenhall, England, which I believe is like somewhere like here. For like three years. Those Dane invaders, they came from East Anglia, is that right? Yes. Dane invaders who serve a man called Ruid. He seems to be sowing discord among Saxons and friendly Danes alike. Years ago, the sons of Ragnar hoped to pacify the land. They appointed a steward named Finnir to find a suitable Saxon king. But the kingdom has fallen into ruins since, with no king and violent raiders ravaging what little peace remains. I suggest you make for East Anglia and find out what their steward is doing wrong. Noise. Yeah, hopefully we can head over there and do some quests there. I will make the trip east then. Speak to this Finia myself. A good plan. And I have to yeah, grind. I did. Put them right over there. Keep them out of your way when you aren't using them. That is actually a very good idea. <laughs> the boy is smart. All right, can we fast travel wherever we need to go here? All right, it's over here. So you've got all the side quests on the way. There's one here, so I'm going to fast travel on over this away. I think we're going to do like one more quest. Yeah, like one more quest and then I'll probably end stream. I just want to I want to try out my new bindings. Listen, I'm just having fun. The game uh especially now that I I realized that I fucked up the bindings. Some an idiot. Uh I think it'll be a lot more fun the combat anyways. Not that it wasn't before more varied, you know, because I can use all my abilities and stuff. No! Oh, right, I wanted... there was a side quest I'm running away from already. Let's go figure no! out what's going on with this. Mm. 
Hmm, is this a... Yeah, no, we're not doing the anomaly. Sorry. Don't like... I do not enjoy the puzzles. Any puzzles, really. If I could just avoid all puzzles, yeah. Please. <laughs> I'm just really bad at them. That's the main reason. Try to find a little bit, a little bit of a land bridge here. I think I see one. Is this gonna help us though? Nah, maybe. If we go like this. Oh, I see a bridge over there. An actual whole ass bridge. Very rare. Seems like they lacked the, te the technology back during this period. For nice bridges. Ooh, we got some points too. Yeah. Go for the headshot damage. Damage. Yeah. Damage and then damage if you're nasty. I think that's what I was going for there. Yeah. There is a side quest. Is it coming up? Yes, it is slightly before our main quest. Maybe we'll do that. Suffering hard times, I see. I saw this. I saw this in a video. What a handsome cat. Hello, friend of Freya. What's wrong? Hey, Nanny, come back, you sneak. Here, little one. Maybe it is what I thought it was. Unless it'll... Hmm, we'll see. <laughs> Got you, little mouse biter. No, this is a kitty. <laughs> so cute. Wow! Nolly hasn't let anyone touch him since old Cutter died. But he sure loves you. Do you want to join my crew, Nolly? You would make a fine raider, I think. Every longship needs a brave cat for luck. And for the rats. Looks like I have another Raider. Hmm. Right, right, right. We have a boat cat now. Heck yeah. I I was mixing it up with some other game, maybe? I, I thought what was going to happen was a uh, cat would talk to us. But no, actually. It's a freaking boat cat. So anytime we get on my boat now should have a uh, little friend should we f don't let me forget guys I'll show you the boat cat before I get off just gotta figure out how to get in this bitch Thor himself could now drink me What? What's happening? Finir? Oh, no, not unless Afton sent you. I did send myself. Yeah, 
Yeah, I wonder what he... Let's pretend Halfton did send me. Then we pretend you're Finia, his steward of East Anglia. Right. How do you expect to find a king for this kingdom when this is the speed you work at? Uh, I found him already. And as soon as he's married, we'll plunk his ass down on that throne. Which man? Uh, you know, stranger, you interrupted a beautiful dream. I was sailing through Helheim, drifting on a ship of fire. Dreams of death often run ahead of the real thing. Oh, <laughs> wouldn't that be a burden off my shoulders? Huh? What business have you with a backwater king, anyway? Danes from here attack my clan. I want to know why and how to make sure it never happens again. Ah, that would be Ruid's clan. They killed the last man I put here, Adelstan. I suspect they'll do the same to our next monarch. A Dane who can't keep the Danes in line. Not much of a steward, are you? If I knew how, I'd have rid our lands of them long ago. Ruid's clan plagues us all. Dane and Saxon alike. You are the sorriest soldier I've met in this country. Kick your king in the ass and fight back. <laughs> he needs more than a kicking. He's got nothing he should have to win this fight. No courage. No army. No charisma. If he wants to live... Who is this limp and noodle then? He'll need the backing of his bride's family. Which he hasn't. They loathe the maggot. Who is he, your king maggot? Ah, uh, Oswald of Elmenham. He was King Edmund's council before the invasions. And like it or not, he's the last Saxon noble with any sway. Why not crown a Dane instead? Half done, Jarl, made it clear. He wants a Saxon king married to a Dane for a greater show of unity. But Oswald's not the sort of man you'd chase into battle with a grin. He's soft, and the settled Danes don't trust him. Where is he now? I'll get the measure of him, see what I can do. You just missed him. He's headed for Elmenham just now, pleading once again for peace. If you go by the north gates and along the road, you may catch him. One second here, guys. Alright, I actually think I'm gonna end this stream. My back's kind of bothering me. Uh, I'd like to get up and like move around and maybe lay down. But uh, thank you guys for coming out. And uh, as always, uh, if you're watching on YouTube, don't forget to leave a like. Uh, it really helps my videos get shown to more people. Um, also... I will be back uh, Sunday at 8 p.m. EST. I'm live. Uh, is it, uh, sorry. <laughs> I'm pretty tired today. Um, I go live Thursdays, Fridays, and Sundays at 8 p.m. EST. Uh, and thank you, everyone, for coming out. Thank you, um, sir, uh, as always, uh, for the live love to have you guys watch on youtube come out and say hi uh, we're gonna find some